Hi, I'm James from UVO3 and I'm going to show you how to change the quartz on the Atlas units. Firstly, we need to turn the power off and remove the lamp and get all the electrics away from the water. Because we're changing the quartz sleeve, we need to break the seal, so we need to make sure we isolate the water. You'll have a pipe coming out of here and out of here. With them pipes, you should have some isolation taps. Turn them off and the, the water to the system will stop. Come back to the top of the system. Like I said, you'll have your lamp lead and your lamp out. We now need to break the seal. We come to the top and we slowly undo the cap. When we undo this, don't be alarmed if a little bit of water comes out because you are releasing the seal. Take the cap off and you'll see exposed the quartz and the O-ring. Remove the quartz sleeve and take it completely out of the system. There'll be a spring at the bottom of the system. This helps with the bayonet of how to change the lamp and hold the lamp in the system. Once we have the quartz sleeve out, you can give it a clean or you can replace it for a new one. Like this system here, if you have a UV sensor on the side here, it's always good practice when you've taken the quartz sleeve out to remove the sensor head from the side of the unit, give it a good clean and pop it back in. If you don't have a sensor head, that will just be blocked off. And you don't need to touch it. We get our new quartz sleeve. We'll take the old spring, put it back in, and we'll replace the quartz into the system. When you put the quartz down to the bottom, you'll feel it go into, it's like an egg cup. Once it's in there, it sits in square. We'll get the new O-ring, which comes with a quartz or a lamp, and put it over the top. We re-get our cap, place it over the top, and start to thread it on. Place your finger inside and pull the quartz sleeve up to the top of the cap. Tighten it hand tight and make sure you don't over tighten it as you can break the quartz. Once the quartz is in and you're happy that you've got a seal, we then need to turn the water back on. Me personally, when I turn the water back on, I will turn the outlet on fully. So this will be the top one, follow your pipe, turn that on fully and the inlet very, very slowly. We turn the water back on slowly as we don't want a surge of water going in and if there's a problem with the seal, it breaking the seal. We turn the inlet on nice and slowly, let the system fill back up, keeping an eye on your seal. Once we have a seal and there's no leaks, that is how you change the quartz sleeve.